true riches and fear not my son that we are made poor for thou hast much wealth if thou fear God and depart from all sin and do that which is pleasing in his sight Tobit chapter 4 verse 21 labor not to be rich cease from thine own wisdom but thou set thine eyes upon that which is not for riches certainly make themselves wings they fly away as an eagle toward heaven Proverbs chapter 23 verses 4 to 5 and he said unto them take heed and beware of covetousness for a man's life consisteth not in the abundance of the things which he possesseth and he spake a parable unto them saying the ground of a certain rich man brought forth plentifully and he thought within himself saying what shall i do because i have no room where to bestow my fruits and he said this will i do i will pull down my bonds and build greater and there will i bestow all my fruits and my goods and i will say to my soul soul thou hast much goods laid up for many years take thy knees eat drink and be merry but god said unto him thou fool this night thy soul shall be required of thee then who shall those things be which thou hast provided so is he that layeth up treasure for himself and is not rich toward god luke chapter 12 verses 15 to 21 children how hard is it for them that trust in riches to enter into the kingdom of god mark chapter 10 verse 24 for what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul mark chapter 8 verses 36 to 37 he that loveth silver shall not be satisfied with silver nor he that loveth abundance with increase this is also vanity Ecclesiastes chapter 5 verse 10 Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth. Colossians chapter 3 verse 2 But godliness with contentment is great gain, for we brought nothing to this world, and it is certain we can carry nothing out. And having food and raiment, let us be therewith content. 1 Timothy chapter 6 verses 6 to 8 Trust not in oppression, and become not vain in robbery. If riches increase, set not your heart upon them. Psalm chapter 62 verse 10 Let him that stole steal no more, but rather let him labor, working with his hands the thing which is good, that he may have to give to him that needeth. Ephesians chapter 4 verse 28 Sell that ye have, and give alms. Provide yourselves bags, which wax not old, a treasure in the heavens that faileth not, where no thief approacheth, neither moth corrupteth. For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Luke chapter 12, verses 33 to 34. But when thou doest alms, let not thy left hand know what thy right hand doeth, that thine alms may be in secret, and thy father which seeth in secret himself shall reward thee openly. Matthew chapter 6 verses 3 to 4 Blessed is he that considereth the poor, the Lord will deliver him in time of trouble. Psalm chapter 41 verse 1 Defend the poor and fatherless, do justice to the afflicted and needy. Psalm chapter 82 verse 3 He that trusteth in his riches shall fall, but the righteous shall flourish as a branch. Proverbs chapter 11 verse 28 there is that maketh himself rich, yet hath nothing. There is that maketh himself poor, yet hath great riches. Proverbs chapter 13 verse 7 He that despiseth his neighbor seeneth, but he that hath mercy on the poor, happy is he. Proverbs chapter 14 verse 21 He that hath pity upon the poor lendeth unto the Lord. And that which he hath given will he pay him again. Proverbs chapter 19 verse 17 A good name is rather to be chosen than great riches, and loving favor rather than silver and gold. Proverbs chapter 22 verse 1 
He that hath a bountiful eye shall be blessed, for he giveth of his bread to the poor. Proverbs chapter 22 verse 9. He that giveth unto the poor shall not lack, but he that hideth his eyes shall have many a curse. Proverbs chapter 28 verse 27.